Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here for the start of a new campaign in Old World Blues, the A to Z series, which we're playing as Lubbock, also known as Lubbock, Texas. Um, it's 2275, September 25th, and we're led by Mayor Irving Watts. Born and raised in Lubbock, Mayor Watts has always been a familiar face on the streets of the town in his youth. Watts made it a point of spending time amongst both ghoul and human sections of Lubbock, seeing ways to restore trust between the two after a series of raids by the jackals that each side blamed on each other. Elected mayor in 2273, in part due to his popularity amongst both the ghoul and humans, Watts had led a series of reforms in an attempt to unify the town. And we have the Lubbock Expedition, which is about to go bye-bye. Although primarily sent West Patrol I-20, the so-called Lubbock Expedition from Lone Star has benefited us in other ways than mere protection. Lone Star units have improved our knowledge of military affairs, and have proven to be reliable mediators between the ghoul and human sectors of Lubbock itself. So, And then we have ghoul human tensions. Lubbock is split in half, in the center of town, humans dominate, and around the airport, the ghouls have their central clusters. Tension bubbles away under the surface due to this division, but much work has been done by the mayor, Irving Watts, to heal the long-held suspicion both sides help for each other. Without them, and help provided by Lone Star, civil war may have gripped Lubbock long ago. Not good. And of course, now we have a generic focus tree, but we're using Old World Blues, Old World Blues Tech Expansion, Old World Blues Radio, Old World Blues uh, Generic Decisions Revamped, and then uh, we're going to Humanitarian Scientists. We also have Old World Blues for the little guys to so give us a you know expanded focus tree for generic focus tree for our regular civilized nations. And then we have Lone Star recalls a Lubbock expedition. With trouble brewing for them at home, we today received word from Chobang that the Lubbock expedition will be returning to Lone Star proper. Their presence has been much welcomed by our military and our people. We'll all be saddened to hear that the expedition has returned to Lone Star. Cho Bang and Captain Saunders both assure us that this is a temporary move, and they'll return in time. We'll see about that. Farewell, friends. So we unfortunately lose it. And it would be quite unfortunate if uh, Lone Star would lose the hand warband. Quite unfortunate. But I went down with the people path, because we started with the people path, with the Mayor Irving Watts. And we really, I, I don't care much for democracy, but to give everyone a voice... I think that would suit us best because we have a lot of tensions between humans and ghouls and of course and with our perspective every person matters oh no who could have seen that coming lone star died oh no now we're with the hand warband 400 casualties to their 600 we're using just infantry it's a little rough um but we it's good well we got right now and hopefully you know as we're going down this generic focus ish tree we can uh do all right Oh no, they're going all the way down here. I'll let you go, He's gonna go there. Uh, you're gonna stay. See what you can do. I hope we can bust through these guys and finish them off. We've got a lot of upgrades already. Doing a pretty good job so far. Outside auxiliaries, sure, why not? And 94, come on, another special forces. And sure, why not? Bull, maybe bear, nice. Could use more caps always. Are we out of guns? No, we're actually good at everything but support equipment right now. Oh no, an encirclement. Who could have seen that one coming? Looking pretty weak, but the faster we defeat them, the faster they'll be dead, and the faster we can recover. Cool. Well, that definitely helps us out. And once we get to Lone Star, that'd be great, so we can get a trade node, because trade nodes are valuable. And this, please. Division. Ah, good. Another division. Good. Good, good, good. You're going to build it in the hard way. How to get upgraded. Yeah, built to destroy. Charismatic. He's lucky. You're going to become Albert Doubleday. He's inspirational. Got a lot to learn. And he's going to be a sniper. Because these guys are already 20 combat with, with chem companies. Which is not bad. But now with him in, with us, we can actually do some more aggressive tactics. Like encirclements and whatnot. Nice. A whole one division. But that does seem to ask a question. Where are we going after this? Are we going to take on the Brotherhood? Or are we not going to take on the Brotherhood? Who's going to be our next target? Maybe Sapper Warband? Probably Sapper Warband. Point distance movement's good. Point defense strategy is good for defense. Go ahead and help them out. And you're not doing too much, so go ahead and help them out too. And open up the combo with a little bit more. And even wider than that. There you go. Pretty good. So once you can do that, that's not too bad. Um, an encirclement, perhaps. Another one would be nice. How about we come here and go bing bong? Right outside, on the outskirts of Lone Star. As long as they can't breach our lines, that's the most important thing. Part standardization is good. Uh, construction speed's good. And special forces, V special forces. They are pretty much the same to us. Maybe actually a little stronger than our own special forces, which does kind of suck, but whatever. Help them out. Or not. K 
Can we win there? Four divisions versus their one. That's pretty tanky. Of course, they are using fire teams, which are known to be pretty good in defense. Actually, they're very good in defense. You want demo teams for offensive stuff and fire teams for defensive stuff, but whatever. There you go. Nice. Uh, oh, but you're going to attack here. But you do have two other divisions attacking from another side, so that should work out in the end. So we get rid of one of their special force div divisions, and so that we can get the, the radar station too. That's pretty crucial to get. Nice, there you go. Pretty good, you got an upgrade here. Uh, Mysterious Stranger, please. We have gone down conventional warfare as well, and we're gonna basically do the same thing here too. We probably won't want to circle another Special Forces Division, but that's alright. It's a little more time to get more recovery. And go ahead and increase political power, expand army training. We can hit, take this small little hit to our attack and defense right now. It's 10%, which isn't great, but you know, it's better than nothing. And it really helps out our army XP, which we definitely need in these beginning stages of uh, our campaign. They only come and do good. Uh, what's next? Vehicle stuff. We got a lot of the basic stuff done. Some of that. Oh, dang, I should have moved a little faster than that. Um, oh, let's go radical. You're going to keep these guys in place. You're going to move in, and then eventually move into here. Uh, huh. Alright, then you go there, and then you're going to go to there to there. And you're going to help out, too. See what we can do. They wanted to go crazy, and I said, you know what? Let's add to the crazy mix. Why not? Well, that looks pretty good. Nice job, guys. There you go. Haskell? Oh, Haskell is the capital. Murphy's Law. Okay, then. Murphy's Law. And our Lone Star is the capital. Interesting. Encouraging women to serve is fine. Uh, let's go with uh, picking our doctrine. We do have ghouls, and I want to maximize ghouls because you don't always get to play as ghouls. I think I would find that a little bit more interesting than anything else. Uh, Brackenridge, it's open and available. There you go. Very good. So we got ta them taken care of. But now we'll probably go to War of the Sapphire Warband, and maybe even the Last Lodge, depending on how big we can grow our army, and if we can core stuff and set up Lone Star as a trade node. Well, I already forgot about it, but we can reform Lone Star. We've taken control of Lone Star lands with this and our former ties to the old Lone Star government. It's time to proclaim a new Lone Star. Now we're new Lone Star. We change our flag. We're not Lone Star, but we're new Lone Star. And uh, we've got a lot of work to do. I'd like for us to eventually reform all of Texas. But even though we have Old World Blues Bitches Formable installed, um, we don't have the option to, which I don't like. At least I don't see it here. I don't know where it is. Kind of sucks. I'd like to form, reform Texas, but that's going to be one of our major goals: reforming the Texan nation. That's going to take a lot of time, but we can also go to war with good old Sapphire Warband and see what happens. Oh, look at all that manpower! We're demobilizing a little bit, but that's actually really nice. Go figure. Huh? Oh, two planes. Okay, well, put them on these guys. I'm hoping they come in and kind of try to walk all over us, but uh, we'll see. Hey, a couple more factories. Oh, we're going to need a lot of radios, aren't we? Oh yeah. Can we do that? Actually, hmm, we'll see. It's nice having a trade node, though. It's very nice. And if they want to keep attacking me, I'm okay with that. Let's see. We're just bringing business, inviting refugees, you know, the good stuff. Uh, well, focusing on planes a little bit, too. Oh, you know what? Let's go and go for triplane attackers. That's fine. Do they still want to keep attacking us? As long as you're okay with that, I'm okay with that. Definitely want you to lead, though. And let you guys go in. Uh, could you do that? Could you also help them out? Because that would be a very fast way to eliminate five divisions. Which would be very nice, don't get me wrong. But this could take probably quite a while here. Lots of manpower now, which is very nice. Uh, how much... How strong are these guys? And we get, well, they got a few thousand manpower, up to 23 divisions. Looks like we're getting weakened pretty badly. They are still attacking us too, a little bit. They really like attacking us for some reason. Okay, send you guys over here too. We're gonna need you. So 157 versus 247. 
invite refugees. Maybe expand the forums. Uh, what else we got here? Another division. Nice. Good. Just go in. It's fine. Let's come back up here. Yes, please. 50. Not bad. A little more organization for our guys is pretty good. It's definitely a mixed bag. And do not let them do anything else. Do not let them move. Can you guys help out here? Uh, after auto saves? If we can at least encircle five divisions, that'd be good. And you're in here too, so might as well help out a little bit. Yes. Trading in and out all the time, different divisions and whatnot. Oh, there you go. Nice. Good job. There you go. Help them out. Good. Help out. Some more. Yes. Expand the farms. And we got setting sail. Why not? Because we can. Keep going in. So leave more. Uh, do at least five here first and then get another ten there. That'd be nice. Come on, we were so close. We were 99 at one point. It's good for our MXP, though. There we go. We got it. And we got to get one more. Just one more tile. Come on, one more tile. Well, it's going to take a while to get this tile. Especially the Special Forces organization just running out. Because they have another division right here, too. Really sucks. Just hold it real quick. We'll get more recovery rate first. And we've lost. Oh, they're fighting the Chain Quiet at the same time, huh? Oh, they're actually doing really well against them. Uh, as we will be doing air based construction stuff. We have no port. Fantastic. Start getting a plane. Uh, I guess we should probably build a port, I suppose. Uh, we'll build one down there. You know what? No. And Lubbock itself. As well as Space Fort. Workman's nice. Rider stuff. Defense brake line. Land doctrine. All good stuff, of course. Alright, so now you're going to lead the way this way. You're going to take half you guys there, too. Hang out, support the attack as well. Now, if the chain choir were to die, that'd be great, but I don't think they're going to die fast enough. We could push in and let them finish off here, perhaps. Simple circuitry. Yeah, you know what? Get the research speed. I've been ignoring it for too long. Air base construction's nice. Rolling ships. Steal the ships. Pretty smart, if you ask me. What are we lacking here? Not manpower, just radios. Maybe a couple planes here and there. Yeah, they're still doing they're actually pushing. It's kind of crazy. Send you in. And send you in as well. Come on, we were so close there. Goodbye, little luck. Ah, there we go. So now I want you to hold. Because if they can take out the chain choir, we can get some free territory off them too. Which might put us in a actually a more troublesome spot in the future. If we are in a two-front war potentially. Which wouldn't be good. But we'll risk it anyways for now. Because if they can get the stretch, that'd be pretty good for us as well. There's still quite a few divisions, though. And we have all settlements. You know, go ahead and increase our political power. Um, optimize trading too, because we don't want more. I am doing that because I want to get to proficient, proficient, proficient mercenaries and whatnot. Uh, Same so man prospector. So much money do we have? Not bad. CQC training is pretty good. Uh, Recon team scout kits. Yes, please. Intelligence. All this other stuff. Um, I want to get. To, I just want to make the big jump from local leaders to military academy officers, which doesn't make sense in my mind. Going from all the way, it looks like you'd probably go one at a time, and it would have a time constraint, in my opinion. But don't tell the devs that, because I, I like the way it's currently set up, because it benefits us very nicely. Um, so, yeah, there's that. And then, plane stuff? You know what? Since we have plane stuff, lightning ray, just start working on some air XP. That'd be nice. And oh, roughly three days. That's not bad. Ooh, someone got a little bit encircled here. More resources. Air Doctrine. Bonus. Nice. Uh, they're pushing in. 
Come on, take the chapel. Take it. See if they can actually capitulate. It's not like they're attacking us anyways. Oop, that's just anyways. So, I don't wait to do that because it just hurts our political power gain, which really sucks. But if I remember correctly, if we wait and go over here, old school tactics, military council. A military council of prominent leaders in the nation put together think of ways to deal with the enemy. Night training give everyone guns popular officers. Train militias, old school tactics. Eh... Popular officers sound like maybe the one we should do. Experience scout platoons, barricades, outposts, rush programs. I'm looking for if we hire anybody new. Elected officials. They were voted in, I guess it counts for something. There's a strategy you know how book. All books will acknowledge many battles for history. You can put this wisdom to good use against our enemies. I think elected officials would probably be best for us there. Come on, just win the battle. Just take it. You're just almost there. You're just so close. So now we can hire someone else. So you're even higher level than anyone else here. Evander John Jackson, you've learned from those who came before. And we did that, so I can also automatically not put on inspirational, but instead we're going to go with local leader. And mysterious stranger. Hey, they found something. Look at that. And so you're a life giver, too. Depends on all how you use everything here. Oh my god. Just finish the war. Please. All right, so that much more money. Um, nothing I really want to do there. Mystery of naval artillery. I think I usually do aerial dominance. Secure the air. Yeah, we'll do that one. Why not? There's unity. That'd be pretty good to get. And we can grab this one too. And we're definitely Oh, fortification is nice. Secure the air. God dang, they're so close. Just lose it. Hopefully getting attacked on two sides. Good, that's good at least. It does make us larger too, which is nice. No one pressing power, which means we can maybe go to war this rapper's compact with, or maybe even the last lodge. We do have quite the thick border with the Texan Brotherhood. I don't think we're quite ready to go to war with them yet, but we could very early on in the next episode, though. Options. Fine. Go and do that. That's fine. Secure the air. That's good. Aero designs. Yes, please. Military command, um, damage to garrisons, it's not that much damage, decryption's not bad, more reconnaissance, army experience gain, and recover faster, ah, screw it, do that one, it really doesn't matter in the end, yeah, I like that one, I always choose build, build, are we still building that naval, no we're not, we have no ports, do we not build a port, naval base, naval dockyard, Oh, oh, there you go. <sighs> fine, fine, fine. Patrol vessels, uh, fleet coordination, naval speed's not bad. Yeah, that's alright. More damage, enemy retreat chance goes down. Let's go with patrol vessels. Lightweight metals. There you go. Alright, so, let you guys push out into there and send half you guys with them. Let's finish this war. Yeah, I just let special forces go in. Maybe they could give them a t contingent of infantry to help them out, because that uh, we're done waiting for them. Help them out. Patrol vessels, nice. Hunting down, hunting on the river is good. Frequency analysis is also good. Come on, guys. Just a little bit more. Refine tools. Even more. We're doing some damage to them, at least. Biplanes, 
barrage balloons can go bye bye. Uh, let's see. Air base up here. Boom. Let's go take an array. That's good. Oh no 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 no. Uh, you know what? Expand that way too. You might as well at this point. Polyalphabetic cipher is nice. Coordination, hunting of the rivers. Good, good stuff. Over here, grab some of this, some more of this. One of these two sides should win here soon. They're definitely trying. We're definitely trying. Maybe division left or died or something. Yeah, I'm sorry this is taking forever. I didn't realize it would take so long. Plus, we are using mostly infantry. What do you expect? Expect better, that's right. Do that there. That'd be nice. Try plane attackers. Alright, we gotta start making some planes. Put down a three. Put a five. Alright, you're, you're, you've wasted my time here. Stop wasting my time. That is absolutely insane that you took this long and got no results. That's pretty pathetic. You guys can just come back and help out here. So we've lost about 1,000. 1,700 versus 3,800. It's not too bad. Finally, you've moved, you fat lards. Scrap metal? Sure, why not? Doesn't matter in the end. We're going to have more than enough anyways. All right. Um, here, go here. Just going to have you guys here too. And open up that combo with more. Ah, good. You're here. Do this. Do that. Train. Cyrus Jones. Uh, and closer support too. Yeah. For right now, I want you to do this. We need we need damage done. I need you to go up there. I need you to do this. I need you to get more recon. Hop out, and so I have you guys up with them. Now we should be making more air XP, army XP, and everything good. Maximize special forces first. It's fine. Rapid redeployment. Nice. We're done with that. Good. And we're going to come up here and grab some flavors. And if that's going to be a distraction, then we're going to attack the south. And let us reform. Hey, they might still win. Seek water? Sure, why not? Lots of money, good. Uh, many prospectors, yes. Uh, it's fine going to do that too, anyways. You know what? We're going to re just find the last lodge because our old goals are already gone. You know what? We'll wait a little bit. We got time. Um, Here, here. Seek some water, reactivate the stuff, get in there. There you go. There you go. Kill them off. Do what they deserve. Alright, they're not going to win fast enough, so. You guys can go there. Repair. You have more than enough to repair with. There you go. And do that too. Go in. You should be able to in general. Monoplane fighters are nice. We're gonna go down here though and grab some of this stuff. Reactive regenerators, nice. Get some old wood, it's fine. And build faster. HP, high pressure, we like them high. Oh, and we finally got them. My bad, that took forever. I apologize for taking forever. But I think we'll start the next episode with us going to war with the last lodge and start moving even faster. 
Oh crap, why did I press enter? My bad. Whatever. Hey, if you're new to the first episode of us playing as new Lone Star, formerly known as Lubbock, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and it looks like I'm going to beat up a lot of Mexico in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.